The FIBA 3x3 World Cup is the primary tournament for 3x3 basketball organized by FIBA. The debut of the tournament then named as the FIBA 3x3 World Championship was held in August 2012 in Athens, Greece. The current champions are Serbia in the men's division and Italy in the women's division. There are two events in the tournament, one for men and another for women. Each team has four players, three on court, one bench. In the first edition, there was a mixed event where each team composed of two men and two women. The match is played on a half court and every rule applies as well as a 12-second shot clock and clearance needed on a new possession. 3x3 Basketball received Olympic status in 2017. Topic. Basic rules FIBA releases from time to time a 3x3 supplement to its official basketball rules. The rules state that regular FIBA rules apply to all situations not specifically addressed in the FIBA 3x3 rules. The current set, both in an abbreviated version and longer format, has been published in early 2016 and a video has been posted on YouTube. Under the 2016 rules, the departures from regular full court basketball are as follows. Each team consists of three players and one substitute. The game is played on a half court, with one basket. A dedicated ball is used for all competitions, whether for men, women, or mixed sex teams. Its circumference is that of the size 6 basketball circumference of 727 to 734 mm, 28.5 to 29.0 in used in the full court women's game, but its weight is that of the size 7 ball 567 to 650 grams, 20.0 to 22.9 ounces used in the full court men's game. A jump ball is not used to start the game. Instead, a coin toss is held immediately before the game. The winning team can choose to take possession of the ball at the start of the game, or take the first possession of a potential overtime period. There are no jump balls at any time in the game, neither is there an alternating possession rule. In any held ball situation, the defensive team is granted possession. Every successful shot inside the arc is awarded one point, while every successful shot behind the arc is awarded two points. The game is a single period of 10 minutes with sudden death at 21 points. The winner is the first team to score 21 or the team with the highest score at the end of the 10 minutes. A tie-in regulation leads to an untimed overtime period, which is won by the first team to score two points in overtime. Note that if a game is tied at 20 at the end of regulation, reaching 21 does not end the games. Game play starts with the defensive team exchanging the ball with the offensive team behind the arc. This exchange is also used to restart the game from any dead ball situation. If a foul is committed that results in the non-fouling team retaining possession, i.e., a technical or unsportsmanlike foul, the latter essentially the same as the flagrant foul of North American rule sets. The non-fouling team will receive the exchange. A 12-second shot clock is used. If the defense gains possession of the ball within the arc, by a steal, a block or a rebound, the team must move the ball behind the arc before being allowed to take a shot. After a made goal or free throw except for technical or unsportsmanlike fouls and team fouls 10 or more, play restarts with a player from the non-scoring team taking the ball directly under the basket and then dribbling or passing it to a point behind the arc. The defense is not allowed to play for the ball inside the block, charge semicircle under the basket. The only common feature between the substitution procedure in full court and 3 by 3 is that it can occur only in a dead ball situation. In 3x3, three three, a substitute can only enter from behind the end line opposite the basket, and the substitution becomes official once the player leaving the game has made physical contact with the substitute. Unlike the full court game, no action from referees or table officials is required. Each team is allowed one time out the officials may still stop the game in case of player injury or other dangerous situations, as in the standard FIBA rules. Individual personal foul counts are not kept. In other words, players cannot be disqualified on the basis of personal fouls. 
However, a player who commits two unsportsmanlike fouls is disqualified. Fouls during the act of shooting inside the arc are awarded one free throw, whilst fouls during the act of shooting behind the arc are awarded two free throws. However, team fouls 7, 8 and 9 are awarded two free throws, whilst team fouls 10 or more are awarded two free throws and possession of the ball. Technical fouls including unsportsmanlike fouls result in two free throws plus possession of the ball, as in the standard full court game. Topic. Results Topic. Men's tournament Topic. Women's tournament Topic. Mixed tournament Topic Statistics Topic Medal table Topic Participating teams Topic Mixed teams Topic Individual Contests Topic Dunk Contest Topic Skills Contest Topic Shootout contest. Topic Free throw pursuit. Topic See also Three by three basketball. World Street Threes. Date the FIBA 3x3 World Cup 2019